Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to reset your BIOS settings back to default on your Windows computer. This tutorial will apply for Windows 11, Windows 10, Windows 7, Windows 8, basically all modern versions of the Windows operating system. And now we're ready to begin. So depending on your computer manufacturer, we're going to have to enter into our BIOS setup. If you're unsure, typically when your computer is turning on, it would be either the escape key, F2, F8, or F12 keys. It, that's usually the key that you would select. So I'm going to just restart my computer, and I'm going to start tapping the escape key, which I believe in my case is the setup. Sometimes we'll actually say it as the computer is turning on. So while well, you can always remove the CMOS battery, as I'm sure you guys have seen tutorials of that nature, if you want to do it without actually having to open up your computer and just use software that's already installed on your BIOS, I'm going to show you guys how to do that method as well. So you want to boot to the boot menu and depending on your computer manufacturer it may be a different key. So as your computer is booting up before it gets to the Windows screen, you may have to tap anything between the escape key, F2, F4, F8, F12, those are the primary keys I've seen. You can Google whatever your specific computer manufacturer is, if you have your model number, if it's like a specific type of Dell or HP or, or Acer or something like that, you want to just look it up and just type in onto Google how to boot into BIOS and then just type in whatever your manufacturer name is and it should tell you which key to tap. So you just keep tapping that key so you can see that's where we're at in this video right now. We're on the boot screen. Again, like I said, it'll be different for everybody, but Generally speaking, once you're on the boot menu here, we're going to use our arrow keys on our keyboard to navigate down to the Enter Setup option. So you're going to hit Enter once you have that highlighted. And you're going to use the arrow keys once more to navigate. And we're going to scroll over to the right. So you're going to have to just keep scrolling over. And you may have to see an option that says Set Up Defaults or something like that on the top. But you can see down in our system key down at the way bottom that F9 loads the Setup Defaults. And that's what we're going to select for this tutorial. So we're just going to tap the F9 key. It's going to say load default configuration now. The yes option is selected. So we're going to hit enter over that to select that. And now you're going to just tap F10 or whatever it says in your system key. You can see what it says on my screen here. So it should serve as a pretty clear guide for you guys. So like I said, F10, I'm going to accept that. So save configuration changes and exit now. I'm going to tap enter to save the changes. And there you go, that's how you reset your BIOS settings. And as always, thank you for watching this brief tutorial. I do buzz able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.